Now let's get to the latest on the coronavirus pandemic. More than 102,000 new cases were confirmed Wednesday. As ABC's John Lawrence reports, that's the highest amount of cases the U.S. has seen in a single day since the virus broke out. Make no mistake, this pandemic isn't over, not by a long shot. And it's not enough for us to just know more. We have to act differently. A report from the White House Coronavirus Task Force is warning states that there is a continued increase in cases, hospitalizations, and fatalities nationally, spreading southward from the coldest climates as the population moves indoors and cases increase exponentially. This is an absolute killer and we have got to stay on our toes. We've got to wear a mask. I mean, how big a deal is this? when it really, really gets right down to it. North Dakota has the highest number of cases per capita in the U.S., but most states are seeing an increase in cases, including Kansas. Wichita's two major hospitals, Ascension Via Christi and Wesley Medical Center, have zero ICU beds available. And Illinois. Compared to just last week, every single one of our 11 regions has seen an increase in the average number of people going into the hospital every day with COVID-19. But some health experts say it's too late to develop a national testing strategy.